Welcome to day number 27th of April Yoga Challenge 2020. Today's yoga asana is one of my most favorite asana called Dhanush Asana, bow pose. So in that we lay down on our belly and we are trying to grab our legs from behind just opposite of what we have done on day number 26. So without any further delay, let's get it started. I show you first two variations and we do it for five minutes. Let's get it started. In Dhanush Asan, we lay down on our belly. We're making sure that our chin is touching on the mat. Hands on the side of the chest. Toes are pointing, deep breathing. In the first variation, deep breath in. We bend our both knees and we're trying to grab at the ankles. If your hands are not able to reach at your ankles, you can also grab at your toes. Here, deep breath in. Spread your knees wide, as wide as you can, with deep inhalation, gently going up, just rising your chest up. Inhaling and exhaling the eyes, trying to look in the center of your eyebrows. And deep, continue breathing. Two, three, four, Five. Inhale deep, slowly going down. Exhale. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Always making sure that uh, your breathing is deep in your navel. Now, the second variation is inhaling deep, full breath. We are grabbing at the ankle or toes. Deep breath in and gently rising up the chest. And we are trying to rise our knees up as well. Have the awareness of the breath in your belly. Have the awareness of the navel. Eyes looking in the center of the eyebrows for the count of five. And making sure our shoulders are relaxed. Making sure that our posture is as relaxed as possible. And staying here for the count of five. Three, four, and five. Inhale deep. Gently going down. Exhale, release, and let go. So for today, when you are finished, you say, stay there in Makar Asan. So bringing the forehead down and remaining there. So you are relaxing on your belly. So, okay, so let's get it started. So we lay down, inhale deep. Hands to the side of the chest. Have deep breathing. Inhale deep, exhale deep. Observe the straightness of your spine. Deep belly breath. First variation, inhaling deep, bending the knee. And we are grabbing at the toes or ankles. Inhale deep, spread your knees wide open. Deep inhalation, open your chest out. And making sure that your knees stay on the ground. Deep breathing. One, two, three, Full breath in, full out. Observe your navel. Eyes looking in the center of the eyebrows. Four. Five. Inhale deep. Slowly, lovingly going down. Exhale. Deep breath. Now the final variation. Inhaling deep. Full breath in. Making sure that your knees are just your are apart just uh, are parallel with your hips so making sure that uh, that your knees are in parallel with your hips not too wide not too too close slowly bending the knee deep breath in gently going up and staying here for the count of five one two Three, four, five. Inhale deep, slowly, gently, going down with the exhalation and staying down in Makarasan. Bringing the left hand on top is the right and forehead. On top of it, toes are pointing, hips are firm, engaged, and deep navel breathing, and staying here for a few moments before starting on with our day.
continuous deep breathing. It's like a crocodile. It looks very passive, sleepy, but it's highly active. Same way. Well done. This was great. So in Dhanush Asan, we did two variations. One more simple and one is a normal variation of it. However, we, we did not push ourselves too much because uh, it's, uh, it's really important that you do those kind of asanas in the guidance of uh, a teacher. So uh, a teacher is able to really guide you through this asana because it's highly interrelated with your metabolism. Also highly interrelated with your Manipura or the navel, navel chakra. And you have also noticed that after we have done it, we also did Makar Asan or the Crocodile Pose. The Crocodile Pose is very, very good to have a deep relaxation. So this is incredible that we have done our challenge of day number 27. If you like today's asana, hit the like button. That really motivates me and encourages me. And uh, if you have any question, you go ahead and comment. If you're new here, I welcome and invite you to join and subscribe to Manoyogi YouTube channel. So you will be notified with all the amazing videos that are upcoming. And also you can have a look on the playlist, what is available for you. Thank you so, so much. I wish you a wonderful, wonderful day. And I see you tomorrow for day number 28. Bye.